soon. This angle is wild, but good morning. Hi, I'm Brooke Moko. Welcome to my channel or back to my channel. Today is Tuesday, May 28th. My phone wasn't loading at first. And it's 9.34 in the morning. I've been up since like 8, so I actually woke up before that, but then I went back to sleep. <laughs> I look rough because this is my waking up look, but I don't care. I'm about to scan these receipts, send them some information for my new job because it's been a process and driving me nuts. But also still drinking my coffee, which is so, so good. If you haven't watched my last video, and if you hear that noise, it's my cat. But if you haven't watched my last video, it's just like your regular coffee pod, whatever you prefer, in a Keurig. I did like eight ounces, however many you want with chocolate almond milk and this hazelnut creamer, the Bridgerton X Delight collaboration. The blue bottle is like hazelnut toffee, I think. Good cheese with ice. Good stuff. Definitely recommend it. I also think I wanna go for a walk or something and that I wanna go get some new shampoo and conditioner because mine has just not been working out for me. Okay, I'm getting ready to go to the store, but I am losing my mind, y'all. Like, ugh! I wanted to work at another daycare when we moved out here, and there's not a lot, and they don't make a lot, which is annoying in the first place. But this one that I finally applied for, finally got, it literally was months in the process. Oh my fucking God. I'm so annoyed. It makes me want to cry, but that's also because I'm on my period. But literally, I'm basically starting over and I'm so annoyed. Sorry, I just need a rant. But like, I used to make, this isn't a lot, so don't even come at me for it. I used to make $13.25 an hour at the last daycare. And they called my recommendations, which was the previous daycare, and they literally said good things about me. I even went out to eat with them after like I went to the graduation for the kids I used to work for last week. We went out to dinner together and she even said she put she put in a good recommendation. She did a good recommendation. She said good things. I'm starting over at $11 an hour. Tell me how that makes sense. And I'm not good at standing up for myself, but I should have because that's so stupid. Ugh. I told my mom after this, I was like, I just need something for now, like, this is what I'm gonna do for now, keep it for now, figure it out as I go, because I, this is annoying, but it's something that I wanna do, like, I loved working with kids, I think I wanna be a teacher, it's just a process, and I'm annoyed, but I am going to the store so I can get out of the house, just do something today, and get my mind out of here. I might even go to my mom's tomorrow because I don't have to go in to that daycare till Thursday morning and today's Tuesday, so. <sighs> we'll see. <laughs> I tried to change the angle, but there's not a lot in here that I can do, but I wanted to give you guys a little mini Ulta haul. If you use the Yucca app, let me know. I don't know if it's like actually works, but I used it today to try this, and I've been wanting to try the shampoo and conditioner, but this one was like a good rated one. It was like 71 or 72 out of 100 on the Yucca app. And then I just got some more of these. Usually I get them from Target, but there's literally not a Target near me. So that is all that I got from Ulta. And now I'm gonna go try to find some food. <laughs> I don't even know what I want. I've been wanting to try Wingstop, but there isn't, there's one opening near us, but somewhat near us, but I don't know. Okay, y'all, it's the next day, and it's raining, so disregard, like, my windshield wipers that's going on right now. I'm, through, I'm going through the Dunkin' drive through on my way to my mom's right now. I'm so excited, because I used to get Dunkin' more than I do now when we lived in Toledo, but now we don't live so close to one. And I still love Dunkin', so when I can get it, I do. <laughs> but I always, my like go-to coffee drink is a medium iced caramel coffee with cream and sugar. And then I got a pack of Munchkins, so. So exciting. It's the next day, it's 
Thursday, May 30th. I'm pretty sure my hair looks crazy. It's basically eight in the morning. I woke up at like six something trying to go back to sleep. Couldn't, so finally eventually got up almost towards seven. And now I'm just like relaxing until I have to go into this stupid job. <laughs> for $11 an hour. That's just depressing and sad. It's so... Oh yeah, yeah. I just want to do it, get on some anxiety meds, find something else, blah, blah, blah. Just all the things like, mm-hmm, try me nuts. But it's a new day. Hopefully like I just go there, sign up for these things and I get to leave and come home and do the rest because I don't want to be there all day. I'm gonna go make my boyfriend bake a little quick. Okay, I got Mario Badescu like face moisturizer one time because my face was really dry. And they gave me this sample because I spent enough to get like these little samples. This shit burns my face. So I put it on and I forgot I did that to shave my face, even though this also is not good for your face. But I need it done. Like it just makes your stuff sit better and apply better. So I'm doing that. And then I'm also over here trying to clean my brushes. I don't have any baking powder, so I'm just doing it with like vinegar, Dawn dish soap, and hot water, and then I'm gonna scrub it after I'm done with this. So. Every time I do this, I cut my face, so I don't know why I did it today when I have to go to my new job, but I'm about to get dressed, and then because of this, I'm like debating on whether or not to do my makeup, but I don't know if I have anything that'll cover this up. Why did I do this? Why did I do this? Next time, tell me no. <laughs> but I just like having it done, but I can't, I don't understand how people can do this perfectly without nicking their face, like. <sighs> okay, I need to check the temperature so I can base my outfit off of how warm or cold it is. And then, get something done with all this. <laughs> I don't think I know how to do my makeup because like, look at this shit. I'm not done, but like, can someone like please teach me how to do it? Like, I'm not the best at this shit and I feel like it's never even because I always have like good lighting only on one side of my face and not the other so I never feel like it's even. And it just is bothering me but we're gonna finish okay, it. I am about to leave soon and I'm about to brush these out but I'm letting them cool down first. This is what I'm wearing, this is what my final makeup look, look like, looks like. I just did like a not so extra makeup look, except my blush looks like a lot. And then I'm just wearing this preschool crew shirt that I got at the last daycare that they made us. Some black leggings. And then I'm either gonna wear my white leather vans or my white hokas. And then my earrings and my ring are both Amazon. And this hair tie is from Ulta. I just got them, but I don't like them. I like the Goody brand better, but this is what they are. I'm also going to go try to film a car tour today. So. Okay, it's a little bit later. I'm back at home now. I washed my makeup off, obviously. I feel so much better. I'm like not the type of person to like wear makeup for a long period of time and to do my makeup all the time because I get over that shit quickly. And that's also why I don't know how to do my makeup like the best. So don't ever take tips for me from me. But the one thing is I love my Rare Beauty Mascara. That is like my top tier every day. Holy Grail product. Is that Rare Beauty Mascara? But I just wanted to get on here and just like chat with you guys a little bit. I just want to talk to you guys about some dreams and some what I want to happen. And maybe I shouldn't be saying these out loud because they're dreams, they're thoughts. Like not everything you want you should say out loud, but maybe you should. I don't know. <laughs> if that makes sense, let me know. But. First things first is I've been wanting to film this car video today. I did start it today, but I haven't finished it. But the car video 
this is my second car i've ever had in my life the first one just was so bad like it was gonna break down on me so my first two cars ever i was lucky and fortunate enough to have my parents get for me and that is the nicest thing, nicest thing that they have done for me i mean they have done so many nice things it was like one of the nicest things or two of the nicest things they've ever done for me but both the car i have now and the car before have been for my parents and the car i have now is slowly but surely every day giving up on me but like it still gets me from point a to point b which is top tier my first car did not have air in it that's what i meant earlier by saying i don't know if i said it in this video or the other one but if you have air in your car and heat just be glad be thankful because that shit i did not have that in my first car and it was miserable but like i think one of my dream cars when i can hopefully be fortunate fortunate enough one day to get would be a jeep that i've honestly wanted like on and off for years but also a mom car because i know i want to be a mom one day hopefully and i just have so many like mom car dreams too but i also want a jeep especially for living in like michigan slash ohio i did live in michigan up until i was 20 and then moved to ohio like 20 and 21 i'm 21 right now but a jeep would just be a jeep and a bronco would be good for the weather around here <laughs> those are some top tier cars that i would want and also moving like we live here right now and I hope within the next year or two I get my ish figured out, get on some anxiety medication because I definitely feel like I need that because I get so anxious about jobs and just being in like a crowd of people and multiple other things. So I want to get that figured out and like get a new job. I am starting a new one right now but it's not something I feel like it's going to stick because of money. Like I, money isn't the biggest thing in the world, but making $11 an hour is hard to move out on your own with. So that is like one of the priorities is just to stick with that for now, get like everything figured out, my mental health, everything, and then eventually get another house. And I hope also one day, I wanna be able to build a house one day and either to get a like a lake house because that's what I grew up with like my cousins and I having a lake house family lake house to go to and hang out with everybody at so I kind of want my future kids to have that too but I don't know either a primary house and then another like lake house with obviously water or just get a pool just like something water because I feel like that was one of my favorite things as a kid I mean what kid doesn't really love the water i mean if your kid doesn't it doesn't but i feel like everyone most people i know have always loved the water and i just want my kids to have like a good life a good home and that is what will always matter to me like i always think about my future even though it may not seem like it to some people but yeah anyways I have some videos that I have to watch before I actually start my new job and I could either do them there at the daycare or do them here and I just chose to do it here because I am still in my period and cramping and hurting so I'd rather be in the comfort of my own home plus these two little babies they're so cute and the cats are in here I think one of them is they're sleeping under the <laughs> they're sleeping under the bed but also, if you notice that I film in this spot a lot, it's because there's not a lot of places I can film around here, especially since this isn't our home or house. It's my boyfriend's parents. This is like one of the angles that you'll mostly see, especially because of lighting. Like there's a huge window right here. So it just makes it easier. Anyways, I'm gonna stop talking. Okay, it's a little bit later and I forgot to end this video so if you guys liked it give it a thumbs up comment down below and I will see you in my next video bye